Well, the gray skies and cold temps can give any of us the winter blues. Yeah. It's a condition known as seasonal affective disorder. You know, I actually got a chance to catch up with an upstate woman. She shares a very heartbreaking truth of what that can actually look like. Be at work, I would just start crying. On the way home from work, I would just cry. I'd get here, I'd cry. He, my husband got upset, he didn't know what to do. Karen Culberson lives in Greer. She's been diagnosed with SAD. The seasons change. It affects my mood, my thought pattern, and that my day-to-day -day life. Karen, now forced to take an early retirement in 2022, a church assistant for close to 40 years. Before leaving, things got really bad. I would have to meet people who were scheduling funerals for their family members who had passed due to COVID, and it affected me. It was so many. She deals with sadness, irritability, and isolation. And in the winter time, the, you have less days of light, sunlight, mm -hmm. and then you have more rainy, gloomy days. The most successful solution for her, light therapy. And it mimics the sun. Karen also credits the doctors, oh, her therapists, right. the support of her granddaughter, who she homeschools, and her husband, who's been in her life since they were kids. But that's not all. I get up and make myself watch you. And so I'm just, I just started with the light while I'm watching you. So. You need to exercise, I watch you exercise. <laughs> but I'm trying to get the exercise and back in to help, to get, the, get me back to what I need to be. She says it's all about finding ways to help her push through the frequent sadness. Her constant fight to find light at the end of the tunnel. And she's not giving up. First, I want to give a big thank you to Karen for being so brave, sharing her story. It's one that's very relatable even to myself. When I have moments of sadness, I notice when I work out, I do feel better. When I get outside or I let light into my home or I get around my friends and family, I feel better too. So if you or a loved one deals with seasonal affective disorder, doctors say getting sunlight or light therapy like Karen is doing can actually help you. They also say taking a multivitamin is a good suggestion.